Hi, I'm Dean. And I'm James. And we're Rolls Bass, and you're watching the AU Review. With, um, with the track, though, there has been quite a bit of traction with it. Um, NME, I, you know, you posted the other day. Yeah, that was crazy. Qu quick, quick little plug for you there. Mm. That's got to be a, a good indication that things are kind of on the right, uh, right track. Um, yeah, absolutely. We didn't, we had no idea until a friend, um, posted a, a, like, they took a photo of the magazine and put it on Facebook and James caught it on their, uh, in his newsfeed. Yeah. And, um, it was we were two just weeks like, old. It was two weeks old. So <laughs> no one, no, no one knew any about it at all, like, uh, within, you know, any circle that we're involved in. So yeah, a friend of mine who works at the <laughs> supermarket down the road was just like, yeah, it's not every day that this happens. And I see, I've seen the creases in NME before, but this is a new one. And I was like, are you kidding? Like, how did you not? Yeah, anyway. So he works at this store down the road from us and we like, we go down and buy stuff from him all the time. So he was just like, these are my customers. <laughs> um, <laughs> But uh, it was, yeah, it was just that we, like James said, we had no idea. No one had sort of brought it to our attention. And it was just this really weird way to find out. Mm. Um, but it's a good thing. It's a good thing to know that we're sort of on their radar and they've, they, however, they've got a hold of it and they've checked it out and they've enjoyed it and thought it was worth, you know, telling mm. people about. So that's good. That's really good. Like, I think, yeah, we've definitely got ambitions to sort of go overseas and, you know, do a lot of touring and, you know, recording like a lot, a lot of bands do. But I think that's, especially for so early on, I think that's really mm. promising and encouraging. So, yeah. It, I, I guess the thing with how, because we're, you know, we're playing in the band, obviously, but we're also sort of running the band. We're self-managed. We do have people on board doing different things um, in the broader sense, but in terms of, the day to day, what do we do? What's the plan of attack? It's 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 just us, and it's kind of cool that everything's unfolded without us having to push too hard. Because mm. um, I did, I, I, I sort of, I, I don't know. I felt like I didn't want to do that with this project. I just yeah. wanted it to sort of reach people's ears um, fairly, you know, organically, just through you know, just through someone saying, "Hey, have you heard this? Check it out," or whatever, without us just sending out bulk press releases and spamming people on Facebook. Like we, you know, we use social media, but we try not to bludgeon people with it. And um, yeah, we haven't, we haven't called in a bunch of favors or anything like that and trying to get the, the music out there. We've just been like, all right, well the song's done and we feel like it sort of speaks for itself. So let's just set, set it free and, yeah. and see if people pick up on it. And so far, the, all the response has been really, really good. So, yeah, very lucky. Yeah, extremely lucky. Mm. You mentioned an EP earlier, and um, touring-wise, you know, is that also like national tours? Is that on the agenda? Well, this is why we're at Big Sound because we need a <laughs> booking agent. Um, <laughs> no, uh, yeah, I mean, we we're doing our first sort of little little run of sort of uh, interstate things with uh, the Blurst of Times Festival in October, which is going to be a lot of fun. Best name um, of the festival of all time. It is pretty good. And uh, that's really exciting. The, that lineup's amazing, and we're really sort of happy to be part of that. A few um, legends on that lineup. few legends, a few mates. <laughs> yeah, that's right. There's going to be some mates chants going on <laughs> backstage. Um, but, yeah, uh, as far as sort of wider touring and stuff is concerned, it's really we've got a... Got a get this EP mastered and figure out our plan for releasing it. And then I'm guessing we'll, you know, do some launch shows and start traveling a bit. Okay. That's it. Keen. Yeah, no, I'm keen. I'm itching <laughs> to get back on the road. I'll, I'll, yeah, I'll jump on any opportunity that sort of makes financial sense. But I'm actually, I really, really, really am keen to hit the road with this band. I think it's going to be very exciting. And I think the thing is as well, Neil, our bass player, he was a, a ring in session guy for, for years for like all sorts of like Afro-Cuban and traveling musicians and stuff like that. So, you know, he's an absolute weapon on the bass, but he's never really done um, like some proper touring and, you know, all that sort of stuff, like rigorous sort of touring like we have in our previous bands. Yeah, it's so. kind of Neil's like first real band yeah. <laughs> in a lot of ways. And it's great because Neil's sort of all wide-eyed and excited about things. And that, uh, you know, I guess two, we've been doing yeah. it for ages. <laughs> yeah. And we've sort of, you know, we're all like cynical and, <laughs> and <old. laughs> but we, yeah, but we've got this dude who's just like, he's just totally stoked on the new experiences. And you know, yeah. when the song went to radio and they started playing, when we found out we had rotation, when, you know, just 
any of those sort of moments happen within the band, it's really nice to have a guy there who's just like stoked, just <laughs> completely stoked on everything. Um, you guys are like, oh. Who isn't, you know, <laughs> we're, we're, no, it's, not, it's not that we're not, but you know, I think you get to a point when you've been in bands for a while where you just, you temper your, um, your excitement a little bit because you know you you become aware of the fact that it, it can be fleeting and um, you know and that, and that it's uh, and you know and that it's all sort of steps towards what you might want to achieve further on. So it's really I think it's really good. <laughs> it's really healthy yeah. for us to have a guy in the band who's just just thrilled Stop to bits <laughs> about everything. Um, and it, you know it makes us laugh. Yeah. <laughs> Fantastic, guys. Well, we're going to leave it there. So cool. thank you very much for your time. Thank you. Thank you very Enjoy much. Enjoy Big Sound. Yes, you do.